Welcome to Blue Eddy Support. Today, we'll show you how to charge your AC300 and B300 using lead acid batteries. To get started, you'll need the DC input cable, the lead acid battery charging cable, and a lead acid battery. Plug this end of the DC input cable into the DC input port of the AC300 and then use one of the two pairs of MC4 connectors to connect the lead acid battery charging cable. Use the clamps to connect the lead acid battery. Here's the cable polarity. Make sure the lead acid battery is fully charged and in good condition. Make sure the PO90D cable is fully inserted. And this switch is in the lock position. Then, power on the AC300. In the settings menu, set DC1 or DC2 input source to others. Depending on which input you're using, for this guide, we'll use DC1. Now, connect the DC input cable to the AC300's DC input port. Locate the white mark on the plug, insert it facing up, and twist to lock. Connect the DC1 MC4 connectors with lead acid battery charging cable. Attach the red positive connector to the red battery clamp and the black negative connector to the black battery clamp. Then, connect the red clamp to the battery's positive terminal. And the black clamp to the negative terminal. Be very careful not to reverse the connections, as that could cause a short circuit. Once you've connected everything correctly, your AC300 will start displaying the input power from the lead acid battery. That's it for today. Follow us for more support videos. Thanks for watching.